Last week, we saw the headquarters of the Vanishing Legion attacked by agents of the mysterious criminal who calls himself The Voice. The attack came at a time when only three members of the Legion were at the ranch house. Aiding in the defense of the ranch is Happy Cardigan, an oil operator, whose successful completion of a drilling contract depends upon his discovering the identity of the nefarious voice. Meanwhile, Cardigan's young pal, Jimmy Williams, mounted on Rex, the wild horse, is riding for help. Heavens, it's Caroline. I forgot all about her. She's locked in the next room. Try the outside door. I can't forgive myself. I hope she's not seriously injured. That explosion must have finished him, boys. Come on. Look out, boys. Duck. She's seriously injured. It's mostly shock, I guess. We mustn't take that chance. Get her things. I'll take her to a doctor. You certainly came in the neck of time. How did you find out? Jimmy Williams met us and brought us here. Jimmy? Where is he? He's outside with the boys. Where's Jimmy? He's with us when we came in. Jimmy! Oh, Jimmy! What you said Jimmy was here? Well, he was. Maybe one of Lano's men got him. No, oh, no. Say, I've got to go after him. Let me have a horse. You better ask the boss. Say, Lano's gang must have gotten Jimmy. Let me have a horse now. Follow that gang and rescue him. Certainly, Cardigan. I'm taking Miss Hall to town. My boys will give you a horse and all the help possible. Find Jimmy, Mr. Cardigan. I'll be all right.
Hey, hey, where's my horn? <laughs> I'll be cow kicked by a mule. That ain't a funny way to treat a guest. The voice speaking. Take Jimmy Williams to Boxwood Gulch. Jacobs will come there. Be prepared for him. The voice has spoken. Tell me who's the voice. Yes. Yes. Quick, man, quick. Who is it? I know you're a killer and you hate men, but Jimmy needs me and I need you. So here's where we fight it out. What does this mean? It means that you're not as smart as you think you are. Get out of the car. Get on the side of the road. Miss Hall didn't get a hold of this. It wouldn't have done her any good if she had got a hold of it. I've got her where she can't make any trouble. Good. That's great. Hello? What can I do for you, Mr. Hornbeck? Sheriff, I'm very much concerned about Miss Hall. She disappeared this morning, and I'm afraid something might have happened to her. He wants me to find this hall for him. What am I saying? Tell him you don't know that I haven't told you yet. Well, I'm very sorry to hear that, Mr. Hornbeck. But if I hear anything about her, find out her whereabouts, I'll get in touch with you at once. No, no, I haven't heard anything about Larry. Oh, thanks very much for calling up. Goodbye. He hasn't heard a thing about Larrabee and doesn't know anything about Miss Hall. 
He didn't seem very much concerned about it either. <laughs> well, Carnegie must have disappeared also. I was out to the oil fields the other day, and the men were sitting around doing nothing. Positively doing nothing. Uh, I move that we get rid of him and hire somebody else. That's what I say. Get rid of him. Uh, well, we can't do that, gentlemen. Mr. Cardigan has the contract. Well, why isn't he working at it then, instead of gallivanting around the country with that Jed Williams kid? Yes, uh, why isn't he working? That's what I say. Well, I think it's very kind of Mr. Cardigan to take an interest in the boy, now that his father is a fugitive from justice. That's exactly my sentiment. I believe you're looking for a man named Williams. Yeah, what about it? I could tell you how you could lay your hands on him. Well, when me and my deputies have failed, we'll send for your help. Hello. Hello, Cardigan. What? Jimmy Williams has been captured by the poison gang. Where did you say they've taken him? Where? Oxford Gulch. Why, that's in Slocum County. That's out of my jurisdiction. No, 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 no. I'm sorry, I can't help you. No, goodbye. Well, aren't you going to rescue Jimmy Williams? Certainly not. You heard what I said. It's out of my county. It's a shame. You've been asked for help, and you refuse to give it. Well, what business is out of yours? Who are you? I'm Jed Williams. I came here to give myself up. But after what I've heard, I'm going to save my boy. And you or nobody else is going to stop me. Hey, where are you going? Sit down. That was Cardigan. Get him. Williams, I've got you where I want you. Drive on.
Oh. Right for it, Jimmy. Your father's life depends on him. I'll try and hold him here. Go on. 